two left. See you later, bucko. Later. 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 I hit Mark with that quad feet. There's no way. My head now. My head now. My head now. My head now. What's good, dog? Oh, fuck. Ah, uh, bro, if you killed me, I swear to God, I was gonna fucking break something.
Hey, what's going on guys? It's Boris Media. I'm back with a brand new video. Today's video is going to be about the Carbine, the MK2. Uh, the best attachments to run on it. This gun is an absolute beast. In my opinion, it's the best or one of the best guns to run in the game. As you can tell from the clips that you've seen in the beginning of the video, this thing is absolutely nasty. It shreds. It just it goes in. Like It's insane. I recommend anyone and everyone to use it. I uh, There's a lot of clips on Shoe House. Uh, I'm going to be honest. I like capitalized on that map as much as possible because it's a small quick moving map and people tend to camp a lot so it's a good map to get your gold weapons a lot quicker so that's what I did um, I did put off making this video for the carbine for a little too long but uh, I'm finally he here making the video I finally got a platinum uh, like you saw on my dragon up video I got my marksman rifles and my sniper rifles platinum so it's just a platinum uh, mk2 attachments that i have running on the carbine and i have the barrel fs s 24 inch factory i think it's the best one it's got it's good for damage range and uh, it just really helps out and it doesn't affect your ads speed all too much i mean i think it's uh really good um i think the tack laser like i said in my previous sniper videos the tack laser is probably the best thing you can throw on a sniper to make it uh, move a lot quicker so you can quick scope a lot better. I use a variable zoom optic. You can use the sniper scope which is just as good because you've seen some of the clips that I hit earlier with using the sniper scope. I've hit some nasty of using the sniper scope but I've just kind of recently switched back to the variable zoom. They're both really good scopes. Even the iron sight on this gun is really good. Like any of the three ver versions of the gun you can really rock and you'll do very, very well with. But uh, pr lately I've just, just been using the variable zoom. It's just something I prefer more. Um, the FSS MK2 Sport Comb is what I use for the stock. It increases your ADS. The other stuff doesn't really increase ADS very much or at all. And I don't run a perk. Uh, I don't think it's necessary to run a perk just because I run a secondary sniper because it's overkill so if I need to reload I'll just switch over to my car 98 or AX50 depending on the class and I'm using the stifled grip tape for my rear grip which is also an ADS enhancer so it makes it a lot quicker to scope in and get people a lot better and uh, this gun is so quick and it's so fun and it's just insane you know I so this is my charm for like any any gun the little doggo I got these two stickers and this is a camouflage this is the the platinum obviously and this is the gold the gold's really really clean on this gun it's super clean but I prefer the platinum uh, I think it just looks a lot better uh, and I use cross thread for the scope reticle um, I think it's just a better option uh, pinpoints okay but I think cross thread is actually a way better option um, but yeah at one point I want to get this one but that's I'm not really worried about it but yeah that's those those are the best attachments on this gun it's what I would recommend to use if you're trying to hit clips or some really nasty clips and you want to be really quick and even if you if you don't use the barrel you can run like sleight of hand so your damage range will decrease but not by a crazy amount probably not honestly because even with this you still kind of get hit markers at some points which is annoying but so yeah instead of like that barrel you can rock like sleight of hand to reload quicker if you're using like something else like a pistol as a secondary or something but yeah so these are the, definitely the best attachments you can run to make this gun uh the most powerful and the quickest it can be at the same time and it's just really fun so i recommend you guys try it out let me know what you think down below of this setup and try it out let me know if you're smacking any clips and before i end the video i just want to mention that i appreciate the growth and that I've been receiving lately and I've also noticed that 80% of my viewers are not even subscribed so if 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 you guys can really appreciate it we just hit 80 subscribers recently and we're really really close to 100 subscribers and uh, I would really appreciate it if we can hit 100 subscribers um, by the either by the end of this month or going into 2020 like the early on 2020 uh, the quicker that I can reach my goals the better and I'd be very appreciative of it and uh, yeah, um, I'm streaming right now. When you're seeing this video, I will be streaming. So the link to my Twitch will be in the description. Stop by, come say hello. I'm almost reached. I've almost reached my follow goal, and uh, I'd, I'd really appreciate you guys coming through. So come say hi. Let me know you came from my video, and uh, yeah, um, if you made it this far somehow, 
I'm glad, I'm happy you've made it this far and uh, like this video, please subscribe and I'll catch you guys in the next video.